In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use my streaky mixed colored paintbrushes in Illustrator. This innovative toolkit allows you to use three different colors within one brush stroke, something that's not been possible in Illustrator before. The pack works a little differently to normal vector brushes, and we don't apply the effect by clicking on an icon from the brushes tab as usual, as this would only activate one brush. Instead, the user clicks on one of the icons from the graphic styles tab here. If the tab isn't immediately open, you'll find it in the Windows menu here. So, to demonstrate, I'm going to draw a line using the pencil tool, like so. And the next step is simply to click on one of the style tab icons, like so, and the streaky paint effects applied. If you want to swap it in for one of the other effects, simply just choose another icon and click on it. To change the colours of your paint, you'll need to familiarise yourself with the Appearance tab here. This tab lists all of the attributes you use within your graphic style. If the tab isn't immediately open, you'll find it in the Windows menu here. As you can see, my paint stroke consists of three individual strokes here, all of different colours, and if I knock out the eye icons here, you can see the strokes individually. To change the colour of one of these strokes, select it by clicking on it and then go to the Colours tab here and simply adjust the colour values until you're happy with it. To alter the width of your paint stroke, select one of the strokes and then open the Stroke tab. If it's not immediately open, again, you can find it in the Windows menu. And just change the weight value here. I'm going to reduce it to 0.75 points there. And you must make sure you change the weight value of all of the strokes, otherwise they'll be mismatched. To change the weight to multiple thicknesses along the line, you can use a variable width profile. You'll find them here. Simply click on each of the strokes in turn and select profile. Illustrator has loads of predefined width profiles, or you can create your own using the width tool, but that's something for another tutorial. Here's a great time saving tip. If you want to apply these settings to multiple strokes but don't want to go through the process of adjusting each one, then you can save your own custom graphic styles. To do this, select your brush stroke and then click on the new graphic style button on the graphic styles tab. As you can see, a new icon has appeared. To name your style, double click on the icon and type a name and then just click OK. Then it's ready there to use when you need to apply it to another brush stroke. And that's how easy it is to create your own multicoloured streaky paint strokes. If you have any questions please leave a comment. Thanks for watching.